And more snow means more shoveling. And even though it may seem like a harmless task, shoveling snow can carry some serious health risks. Portland City officials say shoveling has already led to three deaths this year. WMTW News 8's Courtney Sturgeon joins us now live in Portland to demonstrate how you can stay safe. Courtney. Steve, Tracy, it can get pretty easily winded while you're shoveling snow here. And here's why. You're working against this packed down snow. There's ice in there. It's hard just to move it. And, of course, you've got this pile of snow. And you're working in the cold as well. Well, here's what not to do while you're shoveling this weekend. Doctors at the Maine Medical Center say take your time. That's the most important thing. You want to make sure that you're taking lots of breaks and you're not going too fast. Always warm up before going outside to perform. An orthopedic injury and shock to your heart, and you want to listen to your body. Your chest discomfort, lots of shortness of breath, and pains in your arms, those could all be signs of a heart attack. Portland's fire chief says the people who died from shoveling felt uncomfortable during or immediately following shoveling. My advice to each and every person out there as we face these winter storms is. Number one, make sure you're healthy enough to do that activity. The other thing is don't do it alone and make sure somebody is watching you, knows where you're at. So once again, you really want to take your time and do little piles, chip away at those piles of snow as you're shoveling. It might seem commonplace, especially to the average Mainer who's done this a time or two, but it's advice that you want to keep in mind as you're getting out there, especially this weekend as more snow is on its way. Live in Portland, Courtney Sturgeon, WMTW News.